Yes, sir. Yes, sir. How's it going? It's uh, the Trick or Trey here. Playing some more of that Metal Gear Solid 2, Sons of Liberty. It's going to be a long one today, unfortunately. But uh, sit back, relax, enjoy the show. Let's do this. Alrighty, in our last video, we took on the uh, Harrier Jet. So, uh, let's get this started. I believe Vamp is next. Alright, let's do this cautiously and try not to fall. I still haven't figured out how you do the pull-ups. Let's go back here. I don't want to fall. Okay, let's get that ration. Whoa, 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 don't want to fall. Slowly, but surely we got bird shit everywhere, so hopefully I don't contribute to that. Okay, it's not. Okay, I should be good. Dude, get up there. Get the fuck up there. It's not letting me get up there. Oh, I don't really need that ammo anyway. See, what? Hold up. Oh, I, I was gonna run over there and just do the jumping thing, but I guess that's not happening. Okay. Uh oh, gotta run, gotta run, gotta run, gotta run. Whew, that was close. Okay. No, I did not want to do that. Oh, so that's how you do the pull up, okay. No. I guess it's A to drop. Sorry, I haven't played this in a while. There we go. Something tells. Oh. This is not a pretty sight. Uh, it's not gonna be pretty for you either. Let's see. I'm gonna go with... Let's get a sniper. And do I have any pills? I should. Up, there we go. The One. Uh. There we go. Let's get our rations equipped back. Oh, right, I don't think I can make the jump on that one, so we're gonna have to do this thing again. Yeah, you can increase your grip level doing those pull-ups, but I'm just trying to beat the damn game. I can always replay it offline. Okay, why is the pull-up? I almost hit A. Shrut L perimeter. Okay, we really needed the blackout scene for this. Oh! Almost walked into that. Which way are you going, buddy? Woo! That was close. I didn't even see him there. Okay, I guess I lean against the wall. Okay, A's a duck. I want to make sure. I see I got a duck under this thing. Slowly and steady. Okay. <laughs> I remember this part. What? I'm going to go in my pants. Nobody's looking right. Where you at? Let's get the old golden shower. <laughs> Let's see if this still works in the master collection. The enemy has all. No, that's what I was looking for. Uh, right, my sympathies. Sneaking <laughs> missions are called wet works for a reason, after all. Don't worry about it, Jack. It's okay. Rose? That is, as long as you take a shower the second you get back. <laughs> Do we have a deal? Uh, might as well finish receiving the golden shower of glory. That's a lot of fucking piss. I mean, that's a big stream, too. I wonder if Pliskin will say anything. Or should I say Snake? Ryden, you cover the president. Let's try that again. Have you ever heard of... One more time. You know, I thought I heard... Nah, I guess he don't do it. Yeah, I guess this guard had to go. Okay, I'm done playing around. Let's go. Huh. 
I will take that. Where's that coming from? Well, I guess we'll find out later. I'll take that. Oh, I guess I won't, because I'm full. Okay, they're over there. I guess I go this way. I'll take that. And that. I guess I don't go this way. Uh, let me get some chaff. Okay. Let's see what's over here. So calm. Okay, nothing, so I guess we're going to the left. Let's throw another one out just in case. Okay. So it was surely. Anything in here? Oh, there's a door. Air purification room. Get my drink. It shall one. My father had some unfinished business with him. Wonka, calm yourself. Okay, I guess there's no hidden uh, conversations. Right next to my old man. The launch comes first. What is also up? Not here. I can't trust him. Don't talk that way about one of your own. He's not one of my own. He left my father to die. Remember? Olga, we'll talk later. We need to get started on the final checks for the unit. Final checks. I'm headed back there. The upper connecting bridge to Shell 1 is down. What about the chopper? The cam off is out of action. Take the oil fence from Strut L. I'll tell my men to start pulling out. Hmm. That yet. didn't sound right. <laughs> Their retrieval comes last. The intruder's still at large. Snake. What about the other man? He's got luck on his side, certainly. He survived that explosion. Looks like I did. Listen, Olga, the code confirmation is in one hour. Keep the president alive until then. I know. No one gets in here. Turn the currents on. Of course. Oh, I remember this part. Currents on. Gotta use a the rocket launcher. Shut unless the president manages to take out that circuit panel from inside the room. Then the key, I believe. No job for bare hands. All right. Just like Come MGS one. One more thing. What? We leave for Russia when this business is done. I want half the money for that. Of course. That was part of the agreement. How she didn't see him is beyond me. We start living for ourselves after this. If there's anyone who wants to stay here, I want you to take good care of them. Gladly. Uh oh. Which soldiers are the cream of the crop? It's time they went free. What happened to rebuilding Mother Russia? The old man is dead. The world is a different place now. It's your life. Just as a reminder, I'm going to say this again one last time. Don't try anything on us. The feeling is mutual. Oh. She told him. I'm in front of the room where they're keeping the president. Everything all right? No sign of flooding, but I can't get close to the door. The floor is electrified. Don't test got a spare it. Battery. You'll be bacon. Any suggestions? Remember the Shadow Moses VR training. Take out the circuit panel? Right. But there's no way into the room. Try ventilation ducts. Yeah, I think I see one. Yep. Look for a remote control missile launcher. You can guide it through the duct into the room. Then target the circuit panel. Got it. Right. But make sure you don't hit the president. The president is wired with nanomachines. If we know the frequency, I can raise him. We've tried that repeatedly, but there's no response. 
It Figures. looks like the walls have a built-in radio shield. So that's why Ames lost contact with him. If you need to confirm his position, you can log into the node. Understood. Locate a remote control missile launcher first. All right, just did a quick battery switcheroo. Can't have my uh, controller die in the middle of a walkthrough. It's embarrassing. Okay. Let me get this. Get the key first. Okay. Take some SOCOM. Some M9. Oh, that can get that ration. Nope. Can I, well, let me. Can I use it? Damn. I was going to use one and get the other one. I always use some more chef. M4 bullets. Let me get that node. Yes. Bro, activate the damn thing. Okay, that's why. There we go. Do do do. I think this is the part where the basement's like floated or something. It's been, I don't know, over 10 years since I last beat this game. Okay, yeah, we're going down to the basement. Yep, this is the part. Okay, let's see if there's any collectibles. Nope. Oh, there's a node. Let's turn that on. Alright, got the node. Okay, let's see if I remember this. Oh, what do you want? Colonel, B1 is completely flooded. How are you talking on the water? You'll have to swim through. I'm fine with swimming. Stroke the water and move forward by pushing the punch button. I don't know about stroking, it, it sounds succession sus. to swim faster. Change your heading with the left stick. Up will take you up. Down takes you lower, left and right to face those directions. Okay. The O2 gauge will appear under your life gauge while you're underwater. The gauge corresponds to the amount of air you can hold from a single deep breath. Once the O2 gauge falls to zero, the life gauge will start to drop. You need to be aware of that. Okay. I think I got that figured out. Damn it! I'm sorry, I'm used to playing inverted. Okay, I think I got the hang of it now. That's a dead end. Might as well get some oxygen while we're up here. What's the oh shit! Okay, who's calling me? You have the remote controlled missile. Good job. Now head for the first floor of the Shell 2 core. Take out the power source and make contact with the president before the launch code can be reconfirmed. Hurry. Okay. I'm gonna need to get the fuck out of here and find some oxygen. Ugh, go, 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 go. Shit. I'm used to playing inverted. I'm hitting up and it's going up. I'm used to hitting up and it's going down. Okay, we got the rocket launcher, so let's head back. Okay. I'll use that now. And I forgot those mines down there. Okay, let's go to basement one. Wasn't there uh, a ration here I can get? Let's get a chaff. Oh, there's a ration right there. Okay. The key to bullets. There we go. 
If I remember correctly, you're supposed to stand on top of this. Let's get the Nikita. Oh, it's probably because I hit the uh, chaff grenade. Oh, I can't shoot it. Let's see if I remember the flight plan. Okay. Left. Right. Oh, there we go. Oh, for... Get what your dumb it? ass out the way, boy. Okay, stand your stupid ass there. Stop it! I'm surprised I didn't kill him. I will take that. Oh shit! I'll see how you reload. What is that? Oh, let me unequip this. There we go. Almost blew myself up. Oh, righty. President Johnson. Huh? So you're finally here. You've mm -hmm. been expecting me? Your equipment, that skull suit, isn't exactly standard military issue. Are you all right, sir? Is this some kind of sick joke? I thought you came to kill me. What? I'm prepared to face the consequences of my betrayal. What are you... <gasps> what the fuck? Hmm. What the... You're a man? Hmm. So if I was a woman, well, I don't justify you? what you just did? Foxhound, sir. That's cancelable, Brewster. <laughs> I see. Now things are starting to make a little sense. <laughs> Switch over to nano communication so nobody can listen in. Yes, sir. Do you read me, sir? Uh, yes. Mr. President, it's my understanding that the terrorists have managed to input the code sequence necessary for launching a nuclear oh, strike. Back. That's correct. I punched the sequence in myself. You're working for them? If you asked me two hours ago, my answer would have been yes. Right now, they're keeping me alive until my vital signs are confirmed. drink while this is playing. They betrayed you? I wouldn't quite put it that way. I wanted power. They sought destruction. But why stoop to terrorism? I wanted absolute power. But you're the president. You have power. No, I'm just a figurehead. Huh? I don't have any control. The real power is in the Patriots' hands. The Patriots? The truth behind this country. I'm not surprised you've never heard of them. Very few are aware of their existence, even among those with code word clearance. Huh? Politics. The military, the economy, they control it all. They even choose who becomes president. The old Patriots. simply, the Patriots rule this country. No. <laughs> Hard to believe, isn't it? But it's the truth. The space defense, income tax reduction, and national missile defense programs. Every policy that's been credited to me was actually done according to their instructions. Space defense was initiated by Congress. That's what the Patriots want the country to believe. It's all a show. Democracy is just a filler for textbooks. Think about it. Do you actually believe that public opinion influences the government? No. This country is shaped and controlled as the Patriots see fit. The people are shown what they want to believe. What you call government is actually a well-staged production aimed at satisfying the public. Huh? Don't look at me like that. I'm legally sane, you know. It's not your sanity that worries me. The Patriots. Even I don't know who the actual members are. Are they financial, political, or military leaders? No one knows who the Patriots really are. Even my instructions come from a cutout. Oh, wow. All I've been told is that every key decision is made by a group of 12 men, known as the Wise Men's Committee. Your office? The White House? Merely puppets. Pawns in a game. 
By pledging my loyalty, an insignificant son of a senator was awarded the presidency. Hmm. Of course, that wasn't the only price I had to pay. What do you mean? Even if a pawn becomes a queen, it is still just a playing piece. That's true. I wanted to leave my own mark in history, but my ambitions were... You'll understand someday. I wished to be a member of the Patriots. I wanted to wield the power of a king instead of being an expendable pawn. And that justifies acts of terrorism? Yes. I'd intended to use the new Metal Gear as a bargaining chip. Bargaining chip? But I underestimated Solidus. He actually wants to challenge the Patriots, even if it means the destruction of the world. What are you saying? Whether you believe it or not, the balance of power rests in the hands of the Patriots. They regulate the country's various interests through controlled presentation, staging a drama that is palatable to the general masses. Can you imagine what would happen if they ceased to function? Picture a massive political vacuum, a space that every power monger will try to fill for their own greedy ends. I'm talking about an unregulated power struggle. Panic, civil war, chaos. Like it or not, the Patriots is an organization that must continue to exist. So you changed your mind because you wanted to avoid global chaos. Exactly. When I told Solidus that I wished to prevent disaster, he replied that pawns can never become players. Mm. And who is this Solidus? My predecessor, George Sears. That was the name the public came to know him by. I knew him by his code name, Solidus Snake. He was the third snake, preceded by Solid and Liquid, a survivor of the Les Enfants Terribles project. Neither Solid nor Liquid. He was a well-balanced masterpiece that the Patriots saw fit to entrust with the presidency. However, he fell out of grace with the organization four years ago. When acting on his own, he started an incident. Four years ago? Shadow Moses? That's right. At the time, the DARPA chief, Donald Anderson, together with certain influential parties, initiated the development of Metal Gear Rex and an advanced nuclear warhead. However, this did not fall in line with the Patriots' plans. What's more, Solidus decided on his own to send his most trusted man, Ocelot, to provoke Liquid Snake, bringing about the said incident. As a result, he succeeded in obtaining Rex and the data on the warhead. But in doing so, he ended up revealing the existence of both Rex and the Genome Army, a blunder that earned him the wrath of the Patriots. Shortly thereafter, Solidus was removed from the presidential office. Got yeah, yeeted. I thought he resigned. That's the story given to the general public. Following his resignation, the Patriots selected me, their new pawn for the presidency. But that would mean that the presidential race was... That was quite a show, wasn't it? It was a well-scripted drama staged by the Patriots for the benefit of the public. Even the Democrats and Republicans were dancing to the Patriots' tune. Everything went according to plan, but for one exception. Huh. Following his resignation, Solidus' health was scheduled to fail him, bringing about his untimely death. Capped? Correct. But before the Patriots could execute their plot, Solidus went underground with the help of Ocelot. As he avoided pursuit, Solidus gained control of Dead Cell, winning over Colonel Golukovich's outfit. From there, he bided his time, knowing that his opportunity would soon arrive. What opportunity? The completion of the new Metal Gear project, an opportunity that would even his odds against the Patriots. By stealing the Patriots' most valued project, he would be able to place them in a very uncomfortable position. It's the only chance he has for survival. Once he has the new Metal Gear, he'll declare war against the Patriots. Needless to say, he must be stopped. Metal Gear is already operational. No, not yet. Hmm? What you saw was Metal Gear Ray, hijacked two years ago from the Marines by Ocelot. That was not the new Metal Gear. Then where's the new Metal Gear? Right here. What? You're standing in it. 
To be more precise, this entire Big Shell facility is the new Metal Gear. Would you say? No, I'm quite serious. The upper structure that you've seen is camouflage, designed to represent an offshore cleanup facility. The main structure extends from the foundation all the way down to the ocean floor. The connecting elevator is located on the B2 floor of the Shell 1 core. Arsenal Gear. That's the code name for the new Metal Gear. Arsenal? That's right. Arsenal. We're talking about an impregnable fortress carrying a load of over a couple of thousand missiles, including nuclear warheads, all protected by a horde of mass-produced Metal Gear ray units. Mass-produced? The ray unit was originally designed for the Marines to be used as a countermeasure against the Metal Gear variations throughout the world. The Patriots had Ray redesigned to protect the new Arsenal gear. So now anti-Metal Gears are guarding a Metal Gear. Ironic, isn't it? That's not all. Arsenal gear has full access to the military's tactical network, giving it the ability to exercise absolute control over our nation's armed forces, not to mention our nuclear armament. In short, Arsenal was created to be the core of our country. What kind of idiotic weapon? Weapon? No. You're not seeing the full picture. Hmm? Arsenal gear is more than just a military tool. It is a means to preserve the world as it is. It will establish a new form of control. The Patriots will use it to keep their place as the country's true rulers. Right now, they feel pressured and threatened. By what? They fear an overabundance of digital information. The world will drown in the coming flood of information, and they along with it. Hmm. The Arsenal plans include a system to digitally manage the flow of information, making it possible to shape the truth for their own purposes. In short, the Arsenal system is the key to their supremacy. The key? Yes. The GW system is the Patriots' trump card. Arsenal gear will be fully operational when GW is successfully integrated. Once operational, it will be a completely new form of power for the Patriots to wield. I had hoped to seize the project from them, so that I would be in a strong bargaining position. Bargain for what? I'd hoped to trade my way into their ranks. Masolidus preferred rebellion. Outer Heaven, his plan to unleash a nuclear blast over the skies of Wall Street to break the Patriots' control over the business community, is also a key factor in his offensive effort. Outer Heaven? Listen, there isn't much time. The football served as the key for activating Arsenal gear. I've already input the necessary code sequence. It won't be long before GW begins to establish connections with other external systems and Arsenal gear becomes fully operational. Stop them before that happens. That is your role. Role? You've got to find Emma Emmerich. E She's the only one who can stop that thing once it's been activated. Emma Emmerich? She's the system programmer for Arsenal Gear. I believe she's somewhere on level B1 in the core of this building. I thought the levels below us were flooded. I'm sure they won't let her die just yet, as she's the only remaining programmer for this project. According to Ocelot, she was being held in a locker room located in the northwest part of level B1. Cut transmission and get moving. I wonder how I got my uh, codec card info. Four. It'll give you access all the way to Emma's location. Give this to her when you find her. What is it? A program for disrupting the control functions between GW and Arsenal Gear. Take Emma to the computer room on level B2, Shell 1 core. She'll know how to load the program into the main system. A virus? That's right, modeled after Fox Die, a biological weapon designed to select like personnel with a specific genetic code. But why do you have it? The Patriots had it engineered as a failsafe, and Ocelot forgot to search me. You've got to hurry. That disc is the only way you're going to stop Arsenal. Well, I've told you everything you need to know. There's only one thing that remains to be done. Huh. Now, kill me. What? Oh boy, crazy. 
There's no time to argue. The final check for my vital ID will start any second. If you kill me now, you'll at least prevent the nuclear strike. Cut it out! Uh, he really do it! Up. That's your role! Uh, oh! No. oh. George. Uh, like right in the heart, too. That's abusing your right to free speech, Mr. President. No, Ocelot. This punk ass. Yes. president The president! Why did you... Alas, my finger must have slipped. I'll see you around, carrier boy. Forget him. He did us a favor. Without free will, there is no difference between submission and rebellion. My only real choice is to put an end to this charade. Let me at least have the freedom to end it myself. What are you? Find Emma. Stop Arsenal. That's the plan. This is my last order as your commander in chief. I'm counting on you. <sighs> And he's dead. Okay, I'll get that. Anything back here? Do do do. Colonel, the president is dead. I see. I'm sorry to hear that. Where do we go from here? Your mission was to rescue the president and eliminate the terrorist threat. However, given the recent turn of events, we will honor the president's last directive. You must put a stop to Arsenal gear once and for all. Do you actually think there's any truth to his story about this big shell facility being a front for Arsenal gear? I don't have the security clearance necessary to verify the facts. However, he was the president. I'm sure he knew what he was talking about. Aren't you forgetting that he was part of the terrorist plot? All the more reason why I believe his information is reliable. Huh? We're talking about a man who chose to die rather than risk a nuclear holocaust. Thanks to his sacrifice, the Nuclear Launch Authority has shifted to the Vice President, effectively eliminating the terrorist threat. Colonel, when you put it like that, it almost sounds like I should have assassinated the President to eliminate the threat. That was not my intention. I was trying to point out that there is certainly some credibility to the words of a man who chose death to protect the innocent. The Colonel has a point, Jack. What about the information he gave me on the Patriots? That's a new one on me. I'll see what I can find out. <sighs> Raiden, we're running out of time. Find Emma. She's supposed to be located on level B1, in the core of that building you're in, right? <sighs> You've got to find her before Arsenal becomes fully operational. Hurry, Jack. It's up to you to make sure that the President didn't sacrifice his life in vain. Understood. Raiden, out. Okay. What's your status, Raiden? Snake, the president, he's been assassinated. What? There was nothing I could do. What about the nuclear strike code sequence? He died before his vital ID could be reconfirmed. Then the enemies lost their nuclear strike capability. But that Ocelot guy obviously killed the president on purpose. Why? It doesn't make any sense. They had to know that they couldn't launch the nuke if they killed the president. Maybe there's a way to launch without reconfirming the vital ID. Or maybe they found a more effective weapon within Arsenal gear. You knew about Arsenal gear? Yeah. Why didn't you tell me about it? You never asked. Am I correct yeah, in true. assuming you also know that the Big Shell's a front for the project? You mean, did I know that the Big Shell, a fully functional environmental cleanup facility, was designed to camouflage Arsenal gear? Yeah, I did. It's exactly what the President and Ames described, a massive cover story. The good news is that it hasn't really done much in terms of cleaning up the environment, so we won't have to worry about any toxic gas being released if we have to blow the house down. Right. And when did you find out about all of this? It took a while, but we uncovered the info around the time you took out that mad bomber. There's no doubt that Arsenal gear is being built here. Then it was all set up two years ago, on that day. All of it. Two years ago? What really happened here? I took these photos two years ago. I know these pictures. They were on the news on several websites. If I uh. remember right, the reporters blamed you for sinking the tanker. 
That's right. Otacon, me, we were used. We'd hoped that by going public with photos of the new Metal Gear, we could persuade the government. At least that was the plan at the time. I've gone through VR training of the tanker mission before. Yeah? Well, I doubt it accurately simulates the events of that mission. What's up with VR all the time? I'd infiltrated the dummy tanker to obtain proof that a Metal Gear was under development. Shortly after I made it aboard, an armed group led by Colonel Gerlukovich raided the ship and gained control. Olga and Ocelot were among the raiding party. Yeah, and him. Who are you talking about? A man that was supposed to be dead. Their target was also Metal Gear Ray. But Ocelot eliminated Colonel Gerlukovich and Marine Commander Scott Dolph, and he hijacked Ray. So he betrayed them? I don't know what kind of deal was going down. All I remember is what Ocelot said at the time. Something like, I'm taking it back. Ocelot then sank the tanker, along with the soldiers of the Marine Corps. How did you manage to get out? Otacon managed to have a small boat ready for me. That was the easy part. The tough part was not getting dragged down with a sinking tanker. A small miracle when you think about it. It turned out that the whole thing was a setup to lure us. Photos of Snake, taken by the Cypher, were released to the public. In turn, we became the world's most wanted environmental terrorists. It was definitely a move aimed at putting a stop to our anti-Metal Gear activities. But why did they choose Snake? Since the Shadow Moses incident, Snake became sort of a hero. I think the Patriots weren't too happy about that. You knew about the Patriots? Well, yes, to a certain degree. It seems like everyone knows about them except me. They didn't choose Snake to be a hero, so they decided to do a smear campaign. I think the Patriots wanted to make an example of him so everybody would think twice before opposing them. That's it! They set all this up just to nail you guys! No, there's more to it than that. The Marines Metal Gear Ray project, headed by Commander Dolph, was carried out in opposition to the Navy's Arsenal Gear project. To be more precise, the Patriots considered Metal Gear Ray to be a thorn in their side. Hence, they attacked the dummy tanker and stole Ray. They followed this up with the perfect plan. They immediately sent a fully loaded tanker to the same location and sank it then set up the facility to camouflage the development of Arsenal gear. And we fell for it. Two more puppets in their show. Colonel Gerlukovich and his daughter Olga? Both fell victim to Ocelot's plot. Was Solidus behind all this? He used Ocelot to get hold of Ray, huh? No, he was underground, keeping a low profile at the time. Then it must be the Patriots. If that's the case, what's Ocelot doing alongside Solidus? Hmm. Forget it. We're wasting time. We can figure this out later. The nuclear yeah, strike's been prevented, but Arsenal still has a massive payload of missiles to deal with. Right. If the opposition gets control of those missiles... The right. Ops. You've got to find Emma. Wait a second. Isn't Emma Emmerich... My sister. What's she doing here? You got me. She's a computer whiz who specializes in neural AI and ultra-variable volume data analysis using complex logic. How she got involved in weapons development is beyond me. Hmm. Whatever her reasons, we need her in order to stop Arsenal. Raiden, find her. I'm on my way. Okay. If I remember correctly, we gotta go right back into that water. I don't think I'll be needing a firearm for a while. Let me get this. M9, there we go. Do do do. Oh, let me get that. M4, alright. Let's go, hurry your ass up. Okay, I'm going back to basement one. Okay, back in the water.
We gotta go the same direction where we got that Nikita, but keep going. Okay, I gotta remember, I'm, I'm playing uh, normal, not inverted. Okay, turn... I uh, already got my ass blown up there. Rations full. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, mines, mines, mines don't blow up! Let me oxygen up. Who the hell is this? Raiden, are you reading me? This is Otacon. What's your situation? Wet and miserable. This place is flooded. The seawater that's been pumped up is pouring into the building. I see. Listen, there's something I have to tell you about EE. -E. Don't worry about her. Oh I'll yeah, the bitch can't out. swim, I remember. She's afraid of water. What? Yeah. Now how does she shower? When she was six years old, she almost drowned with my father in our swimming pool. She can't swim? Well, yes and no. We used to swim a lot together when we were kids. In fact, she swam like a fish until that day when she almost drowned. When the accident happened, I was in my room. I learned later that E.E. E. was calling me for help. She didn't doubt for a minute that I'd be there. You could see the pool from my room, but I didn't realize at the time that she needed my help. What were you doing? I... I was... So Emma survived the ordeal? Yeah, but my father didn't. So you blamed yourself and left your family? No. E.E. E. seems to believe that was the case. The fact is, I betrayed her. And you think she can't swim because of the traumatic experience? I haven't seen her since that day, but yes, I think so. I got a letter from Julie, her mother, after they moved back to England. In her letter, she mentioned that E.E. E. couldn't swim anymore, that she refused to even wear a bathing suit. Damn, if she still can't swim, we're in trouble. Level B1 in the core Wait, is pretty much She flooded. in trouble. Look. <laughs> Maybe you can help her overcome the trauma. You want me to help her get over it? Well, it's still gonna take some time to repair the cam off. Sorry, kid. Emma's rescue is up to you. <laughs> Thanks. An underwater mission. Well, this is a first. Look, I'll see what I can do. I suggest that you drum the map of the building into your head, because you won't have time to look at it when you try to bring Emma out. I'm counting on you, Raiden. I covered most of the core when I had to take out the C4s. If there's anything you need to ask me, call me on the codec. I'll do that. Still don't see it. Oh, he's not on the water anymore. Okay, we are going here, right here. Bitch did. Oh yeah, that's a bomb guy. Okay. Let me get some more air. Ugh. There we go. I didn't want to encounter any more landmines, I can bear I mean, uh, mines, because I couldn't see in there. Go up, go up, go up, go up, go up. Okay. I just, I just saw a door. Can I, can I use this? Nope. Okay, we're not walking on the ground. We need to get the fuck out of here. I think this is where Vamp's boss fight is, so let me go ahead and equip the weapon. How do you reload? I totally forgot. Okay, you just switch it on and off. That's how you do it. Yep, I was right. This is a relatively easy boss fight. It's just kind of annoying sometimes. I just don't get how he's able to float on water. Still ticking, huh? Boy, I got a glory hole in the middle of his forehead. Hell had no vacancies.
Mm-hmm. Three is your ass. <laughs> All right. Well, let's see. Human muscles are quite eloquent. They speak out clearly what a person's next move will be. They even tell me which way a gun is going to be pointed before the trigger is pulled. But your muscles, they're different. That's money sauce. This should be fun. Well worth the wait. Marty suspect again, man. You gotta say no, Diddy. You knew I was coming? You've become a nuisance. I can't let you interfere with Arsenal gear. The girl is just ahead. She is of no use to us now. But she served us well as the live bait for the big catch. Crazy Ivan sometimes speaks the truth. Emma's alive? There goes she e. was some time ago. But the flooding has become quite serious. I wouldn't be surprised if she's a mermaid now. What? Did you really think killing the president would prevent a nuclear strike? Think again. I didn't do it. <laughs> Arsenal is still armed with a purified hydrogen bomb. Purified hydrogen bomb? This is no ordinary nuclear bomb. This weapon is capable of heavy hydrogen nuclear fusion using lasers and magnetics to generate heat insulated compression. It was a top secret project initiated by the current president. And Solidus has no idea of its existence. The clean thermonuclear bomb is at an experimental stage and is handled differently. Specifically, it becomes launch capable when Arsenal is activated. A nuclear threat still exists. Six months ago, we lost everything we believed in. We were abandoned to take the fall in their cover-up. We were labeled as killers responsible for the mass murder of civilians as well as our own allies. And the public believed every word, turning a deaf ear to whatever we had to say to the contrary. Our only goal is to wipe them from the face of the earth and destroy this world of deceit they have created along with them. You're insane. Insane? We might be the only ones telling the truth. Uh-oh, it's purge time. Final check for activating Arsenal has been completed. All Arsenal personnel report to your stations. Well, it sounds like Arsenal's ready to go into operation. Damn it! You're still hoping that the girl can install that virus you're carrying around, aren't you? You know? <sighs> it's a shame you're not going to be around long enough to hand her the program. That isn't seawater, you know. It's a byproduct of the microbes contained in the pool. Buoyancy is practically non-existent thanks to the high oxygen content. Once you fall in, you don't come up. Mm. Take a good look at your grave. But yet you're standing on it. That's what I don't get. Show me what you've got. Well, I'm gonna show you what I got. Okay. We got that equipped. Let's take him out, bitch. Let's get these lights. He's gonna be in the water for a while. Motherfucker. Get the lights, get the light. Oh shit, he got me in the ass. Where he at? There he is. Bitch. Okay, I still got a rocket launcher, I believe, so let's bring him to the surface. Let's get that SOCOM and get some more bullets. No, you don't. No, you don't. Woohoo! Woohoo! Yeah! Oh, 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 no you don't! Oh shit! Hold me on! It's not that bad of a fight, it's just annoying. Okay, let me get that so calm. Whoa. 
Oh shit, now he's behind me. Oh, there he is. Oh, oh, oh. I gotta get him. How did I miss that? There we go. Hey, man. Uh oh. Oh, no. No, you don't. Where'd he go? He's probably up top somewhere. Oh, he's right in front of me. <laughs> Shit. Okay. Come back to the surface, man. Let me get my soul cone. There you are. Bitch. Shit. Shot that knife out of midair. Got some more SOCOMs. Got them right in his ass. Uh, what am I doing? What am I doing? Uh, Stinger. Let me get my SOCOM back. There he is. Oh, he's right in front of me. Woo -hoo -hoo! Oh, shit. Woo! No, you don't, man. That was a waste of a bullet. I only got two of these left, so. Come on, man. There you are, bitch. Oh, shit! He's bum rushing. Oh, shit, where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Oh, shit. Where are you? Yeah. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. I got hit. Come on, I shot him. All right, I believe this is my last rockets. I never tried grenades. I don't know if those work. Let's go ahead and get two of those. Let's get this soak on. Oh! Get him, get him, get him! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh, no! Where are you at? Probably behind me. Oh, he's up, he's up there. Okay. Where, where, where? Yeah. Let's see if grenades work. They do. Nice. Take his ass out. Oh, shit. He's bum rushing. Oh, damn, he got me. Oh, not a, no, you don't. No, you don't. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, let's get another grenade in there. Oh, shit. And I have to switch to this. Let's get a different weapon. Shoot, shoot, shoot! Damn! I'm just gonna wait for him to come out. He's almost done. Oh, shit! No, man! I mean, yes, he got me. Gonna taunt me. Okay, let's get a grenade in there again.
Let me get another weapon. Yeah. Where he at? Got his ass. Woo! Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. For some reason now the water affects him. I mean, it's still a good game. Okay, let's do the little codec thingy. Colonel, they've apparently completed the final check procedure for Arsenal gear. Find Emma on the double. You've got to get her to install the virus program that the president gave you. When you find her, take her to the computer room on level B2 in the core of Shell 1. Snake, did you catch all that? I didn't make it on time. Arsenal's going active. Yeah, I heard. The hostage rescue's gonna have to wait. I'm going after Emma. We'll secure the computer room. Looks like we can't install the virus program without Emma. Can't your partner do it? I would if I could, but the security for this system is no joke. I need more time. That's why we need her. Understood. I'll make sure you have your family reunion. Uh, what's up? A lot of years have passed between E.E. E. and me. Then you should see her, right? I don't have the right to see her. We can talk about this later. Raiden, I think you'd better get moving. Emma's in the locker room to the north, right? I'm on it. Locker room to the north. Let me collect all the goodies in here. Okay, I guess I already collected. I gotta use at least a couple more rations. Oh, there's one. Oh, more water. Oh shit. I don't have the node. I don't even know where to go. Hopefully I'm going the right direction. Okay, there's a node. Let me download. That was just pure luck right there how I found this place. Okay, let me get that. Okay, I remember this room. Yeah, it's on the radar. Emma's there, so let me open these, uh... These real quick. You got a book. That one's locked. Can't bust it down. Got some C4. That one's locked. That one's locked. What about this one? That one's locked. What about this? Okay, that one's open. What's that? Thermal goggles. Nice. That's going to come in handy. Okay. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. She's kind of cute, though. Oh, damn. That bitch pissed herself. So. <laughs> Are you all right? Who are you? I forgot Why? she did that. Get you <laughs> out of here. Just like her brother. Get me out. You're lying. Where are you taking me this time? What are you talking about? I'm here to help. Here. I'll prove it. Do you have nanos? What? Well, do you? I do. Everybody on this project has them. Okay, good. Let's try. I mean, they're sitting right there. Why can't they talk? Now? Nano communication? That's right. I have nano machines. Just like the president. Too. Then you're not one of them. That's what I've been trying to tell you. And you came to rescue me? Actually, I need your help to stop Arsenal. I understand you're the only one who might be able to do it. And who told you that? The president. Really? I need you to come with me to Shell One. Your brother's waiting for you there. My brother? Come on. We have to get moving. This place will be flooded soon. Ugh.
I'm not sure why this scene went in slow mo. Swim. I would if I you could, trust me. Love it. How do you know? Your brother told me. He's really here? That's right. He's here to rescue you. I don't believe you. He would never come for me. And I'm telling you he's here, waiting for us at Shell One. No! He left me, my mother, when we needed him the most. When my father died, all he could think about was himself. Emma, we can go over all that later. But first, we have to get out of here. No! I hate water! It's hopeless. I can't swim. I you know can't what else we'll have to get in to do? You can do it. I can't. Come on. Deep down inside, you know you can swim. I can't keep my eyes open in the water. That endless blue. The water, it, it wants me. It won't let me go. All right. Then close your eyes. I'll guide you. I, I, I was injected with something. My, my legs. I have trouble moving them. Listen, Emma, just hold your breath. I'll do the rest. First, we'll head to filter chamber two. Then we'll take a break. And all I have to do is hold my breath. That's right. That's all you gotta do. How long? Just a little while. Are you sure? Of course I'm sure. That's how I got here. I, I don't think I can do it. I'm not good at holding my breath. Well, Look, you're Emma, gonna have to. I have an idea. Put your ear against my chest and listen to my heartbeat. Your heartbeat? Count the beats. Don't think about anything else. When you reach 100, open your eyes. By that time, we'll be on the other side. Give me a signal if you think you're running out of breath. What will you do then? I'll swim faster. <laughs> I'll swim faster. Hang on tight. Okay, now that I got the okay, node, I should be able go. to find my way back. I'm closing my eyes. Take some deep breaths. One, two, three. Wait. Really? What is it? Uh, let me take off my glasses. You know, you should wear contacts. There's nothing wrong with my eyes. Hmm? Huh? I wear them for show. Hmm. Trying to be different from the other girls? No, it's not like that. I like glasses. And there's this guy I liked who used to wear them. Your first boyfriend? No. Somebody more important. Anyway, they bring me luck. I see. Okay, let's go. Alrighty. Trying to run into a uh, sea mine. Oh damn, Emma ain't got no oxygen. Holy shit. Uh, I guess we go up here. Oh shit! I walked right into that. Where the hell am I going? Okay, let's try not to hit. I accidentally hit, you know, the button by accident because I'm used to playing, uh, inverted. Oh, there we go. Come on, get, get your ass up there. Oh, you seriously not walking? Oh, okay. I forgot I got the holder. And this is where we take the break. You did good. I concentrated on your heartbeat. It reminded me of when I was a kid.
I remember my brother giving me a piggyback ride. I was sleeping with my ear against his back. Uh, my feet. Ooh, Sounds that like felt you were good. close. We were back then. We were stepchildren in our parents' second marriages. Wherever my brother went, I used to tag along. My brother didn't have any close friends, so he used to take care of me. We both wanted to be loved so much. So much that we used to pretend. Pretend? Yeah, we used to play house. My brother was the husband and I was the wife. Hmm. Stepsister! But it was always just make-believe. We were only kids. You know what I mean. I never had a family, but I think I know what you mean. Raiden, what's your status? Colonel? I've got Emma Emmerich here. We've managed to avoid drowning. Good job. Get her over to Shell 1 as soon as you can. That's going to be hard with the connecting bridge on the upper level destroyed. Didn't Olga say something about taking the oil fence at the bottom of Strut L? Yeah, I remember that. You should be able to go down by way of Strut L. Try and get over there. What about Emma? She's been injected with something and she can't walk without any help. Take her with you. Free your hands of any equipment and hold down the action button to give her a hand. To release your grip on her, take your finger off the action button. Emma can sit and wait until you help her back up. And be careful. You won't be able to use any weapons while you're leading her. Now head for Strut L. We're on our way. Raiden, we've infiltrated the computer room. What's your situation? Emma's safe. We're heading your way. <sighs> Good job. Shell 1's deserted. Looks like everybody's aboard Arsenal. I had a look at the system, but there's nothing I can do. EE's our only hope. Right. I'll put her on then. Huh? EE? -E? What? How? I'll use my Kodak as a relay. Uh, <clears throat> Here she is. How? Uh, EE, -E, is that you? How? EE. -E. Um, why are you involved with Metal Gear? Huh? You knew our family's dark history and still got involved? What's wrong with you? I should have known. Answer me. Why are you repeating the same mistake? I... I wanted to hurt you. I wanted to see you suffer. E.E.? -E? You mm. abandoned me. No, that's not what happened. All right. That's enough. Yeah, for real. Not at the time. Who are you? I'm a friend of Otacon's, Emma. Otacon? Enough with the sibling rivalry. That's not what this is. We haven't got time for this. Raiden, get her over here right now. I... I... Gotcha, Snake. I'll head over there with Emma. Most of the enemies aboard Arsenal, but I suggest you be careful. Make sure Emma gets here in one piece. Raiden, take care of my sister. Don't worry. I'll get her there. Okay. Let's try this again. Doo -doo -doo. Where are you? There we go. Okay, slow bitch, let's go. Time for some more underwater adventures. Emma, Snake and Hal are waiting for us in Shell One's computer room. I've got this disc that the president gave me. This disc is supposed to contain a virus that can corrupt Arsenal Gear's operating system. We need you to... This is... This is my program. What? Why did the president give it to you? Uh huh? Did something happen to the president? Yeah, that motherfucker did. The president. He's dead. What? Yeah, shocker. You actually wrote this virus? It's not really a virus. It's more like a worm cluster. It's actually a delayed effect autonomous program that's designed to invade GW's cerebrum and render its nerve connections useless. You know what GW is? Of course. I created it. Huh? Is that so? You look surprised. Uh, well. Cat got your tongue? I'm sorry. I. How about the Patriots? Ever heard of them? Yes, but I only know what I've been told. 
Can you tell me what you know? Um, sure, but it's hard to put into words. Right. Are you reading me, Emma? Yes. Lab We're standing right next to each the other. The president said that arsenal gear was the Patriots' key to supremacy. That's as good a description as any. What exactly is it? It's a massive data processing system capable of controlling information on a global scale. A data processing system? That's right. The system is a social device for maintaining the Patriots' control. You've lost me. Well, in this day and age, information emerges from every direction and is freely distributed. A variety of information gathered by servers employing the latest in high-speed communication networks and P2P technology is rapidly circulated to individuals. In fact, the speed of this circulation process is accelerating on an almost daily basis. The Patriots seem to be afraid of this development. Apparently, they believe that their role will shift from dominant to dominated. Huh? But let me give you an example. You're aware of Solid Snake's anti-metal gear activities, aren't you? Yeah, I know a little about it. Well, that's just a small sample of uncontrolled information. I can guarantee you the Patriots did not want Solid Snake's name publicized. Now, look at it like this. Political scandal, corporate corruption, up until now, the Patriots have managed to keep a lid on these and other self-serving events. But with their existing data processing system, they're no longer able to effectively control the flow of information generated at the individual level. With the newly created system, they can fully regulate digital information. High-level information can be categorized in stages, given clearance levels, and deleted as necessary, never to be seen by the public. By deleting such information, the Patriots can shape the course of history as they see fit. Somebody's bound to catch on. No, the memory capacity, not to mention the lifespan of the average individual, is extremely limited. On the other hand, digital information lasts virtually forever. It doesn't deteriorate. So? The alphabet. 26 letters, right? It could have been 30 letters. What if the four deleted letters were controlled by a program? Impossible. It's not. In fact, something similar is already underway. Do you know how many genes exist in an individual? About 30 to 40,000? Right. That's what was announced at the turn of the century. But there's actually a hundred well, thousand points to the original the theory mine's advanced almost empty. by the scientific community. Information regarding the remaining 60,000 was suppressed by the Patriots. No. Why? How would you know? Do you know what a gene looks like? Did you count them yourself? There are research organizations. Of course. And their reports have already been subtly altered. They're even beginning to believe the doctored reports. GW is a system that allows the Patriots to decide what will be recorded in tomorrow's history. So what we're talking about is one huge censorship system for deleting information which might be inconvenient to the Patriots. Exactly. The actual physical core for handling the task, GW, is installed in Arsenal. It's the only system in the world with an optic neural AI that has a parallel processing capacity of 980 trillion hammets. I suppose that being a specialist in neural AI and complex logic played a significant role in your association with the Metal Gear project. That's not the only reason. What do you mean? Huh. I guess there are plenty of other reasons. Yes, there are. I understand. Do you? So Arsenal Gear was actually designed to protect the GW system, wasn't it? Um, yes. It's armed with everything, including nuclear weapons, and is fully equipped with cyber-terrorist countermeasures. Physically and logically, it's the ultimate fortress for housing GW. But is the Ooh. AI actually capable of controlling uh, everything? No. GW is only the system's core. It's only for deciding what data is stored or deleted. The actual subsystem for executing the task exists within our social structure. What? Do you remember the panic that gripped the computer industry prior to the end of the century? You mean the Y2K problem? That's right. If you recall, our government supplied the world with a countermeasure program, using the internet at full capacity. The program was distributed to every governmental organization, every key facility throughout the world. In addition, the same program was included in an OS application for distribution among the public. Let me guess. The Y2K countermeasure contained a program designed by the Patriots. Yes, and everything supplied from that day onward contains the same program. Impossible! Do you know how a computer operates? Do you really know the basic principles on how data is exchanged? Uh, 
Nobody's aware of it, but there's a subsystem in place, and it's about to be activated. Is that why Solidus wants to burn out every electrical circuit in Manhattan with a nuclear blast? Probably, but the overall system isn't actually complete. What? It still lacks the necessary factors for judging situations. I heard they were planning a major experiment in the next few days to provide complex data for GW to study. And suddenly all this happens. Emma, it's not your fault. If it wasn't for the terrorists... Yeah, you're right. Well, I think that's about all I know. Right. Uh, thanks. I think we'd better head for the computer room. <sighs> My bird in the computer room! Is he safe? That noisy oh, overgrown parakeet? Excuse me, he's a parrot. And he's my best well, friend. Annoying. My only friend. Well, the bird's okay. Good. Did you know that in the old days, miners used to take a canary into the mine shafts to detect toxic gas? That's what he's for? No. I really needed someone to talk to. What was the purpose of sharing but that with I you? I think we'd better get moving. We've got a little longer to cover than the last time. I'll give it my best. Whatever you do, don't open your eyes. Why not? A dead body, not a pretty sight. Oh. Yep, nice and dude. Once we get past it, it'll be too dark to see anything. What are those sticks in your head? These? They're lacquered chopsticks. They hold your hair in place. Did you know that they're pretty popular in Europe and South America? Can't say that I do. You're not only cute, but smart too. Oh, mm -hmm. I'm much more than cute. Oh, is that so? Okay, let's go. I know her legs don't work that well, but can they still spread? <laughs> Let me get my mind out the gutter. Okay, I gotta remember this is not inverted controls. Let's just go ahead. Oh, I thought that was a mine. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, get her some air. No, we're going this way, I believe. Crap, we gotta go. We gotta go. Gotta get her some more air. How do I get out of here? This bitch is running out of air! There we go. Gotta watch out for the mines. She is about to run out of oxygen. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Whew. I'm almost drowned. Nope, not that way. This way. There we go. Okay. I know if you lay down and get one of these on you, you can like beat the game with a, uh, there we go, like that. Oh, and it gave me a trophy. Okay. Let's go. You kidding me? Get your ass up, let's go. We're gonna do it my way then. Do do do. I think you're supposed to use a coolant and like a spray that I ain't got time for all that. Let's go. Get your ass up in here. Let me get this. Hopefully I'll get canceled for that. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna need you to stay here. Freeze. <gasps> One down. Okay, there's one over there. Got him out of there. Okay, I think I saw all of them. 
Should be a straight shot. Let me go and get her. Can always use some more soap on. All right, let's go. Oh, I gotta put the. That was totally an accident. Okay. It's time for this slow ass walk. -off. Oh shit, it's like he woke back up. Freeze. <laughs> mm hmm. Nighty oh. night. Let me go back and get her ass. Let's go, Emma. They should be out for a while, so I'm gonna worry about them waking up. Oh crap. Let's put you here. Oh, there he is. That was a complete waste of ammo. Freeze. <gasps> mm-hmm. Uh. Wonder why he wasn't popped up on the radar. Let's go. Oh crap, one's loose. I mean uh, one's up. Oh crap. Oh shit. Ooh, that was close. Okay. We should be good now. I think I heard a cipher. Yep, there's one. Let's get him out of here. PSG one and chaff. Thought I heard another one. Okay, uh, I want to equip that. Oh crap! 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 I am so sorry. Another one? Get out of here! Okay. They really nigger rigged this bridge. <laughs> what they use? Uh, sh shed doors. Someone's coming. Oh shit. No, you don't. That was another close one. Hey, if I remember, what's that? Okay, if I remember correctly, I believe he used this. Yeah, I was supposed to use this to clear those, uh, Broach things, but uh, I ain't got time for this, so I just knocked her ass out and carried her. Will you go out already? Come on, before this fire comes back. Do, 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 do. It's like there's some goodies over there, but screw it. 
Damn it. No, oh, level five. This I don't think door I got that card. Security level five. I don't have card five. Damn. Oh, I forgot she has it. Giving up already? Ta da! What the? Are you impressed? You should have told me you had it. Well, the truth is, I just remembered it myself. <sighs> Hasty beverage. Okay. See if I get him. Come on. Man, you're going right back to Nighty Night. There we go. Then you're wasting all my damn trinks. Let's go, Emma. Do -do -do. Oh, the part coming up I hate. I used to hate this when I was uh, back in the day playing this. Okay, here we go. Question for you. What is it? How do you feel about heights? Makes no sense. I can't say We're I standing like next heights. to each other. The water's higher on my phobia list. Why? Well, we have to go down a ladder. How far down? Just a little bit. Why do I feel like we've had this conversation before? How little is little? Mm, about 130 feet. Hmm. Huh. Think you can do it? Would you take no for an answer? How are your legs? Better. The numbness is gone. I can climb down on my own. Okay, follow me. Damn, I'm afraid to hide some real life. That got me scared. Oh, this is a beautiful sunset. If we don't hurry, it'll be the last we see. Enemy soldiers, gun ciphers. I don't think we're gonna be able to slip past all that. Looks like it can barely support one person. How much do you weigh, Emma? Are you gonna ask me how old I am next? <laughs> if you go alone, I think you can make it across. This is Ryden. Do you read me? Yeah, what's up? We've made it to the lower part of Strut L. We'll have to cross the water from here. Can Emma walk? Yeah, she's okay. The pontoon bridge doesn't look too sturdy. Emma's gonna have to cross it alone. Right. The oil fence. There are ciphers and several guards. Ryden, you're carrying a PSG-1, are you? Yeah. It's time to play sniper. Yep, Not bad. sniper. This spot gives me a good view of the targets. You're going to have to cover Emma until she crosses to Strut E. I'll get there and provide some support of my own. Thanks. 
Think you can handle it? Yeah, I know the drill. I faced a similar situation in advanced mode level 4 VR training with Always the PSG-1. Like this is real life, dude. Uh, guess it's better than nothing. Make sure you don't hit Emma. Right now, with Arsenal's boarding in progress, security should be at a minimum. That doesn't mean it's going to be easy. Given the situation, they probably got claymores in place to make up for the security shortage. Make sure you use your thermal goggles. Good thing right. I picked those up. Okay, I'm heading for strut E. Emma, are you reading me? Loud and clear. I'm gonna clear a path for you from here. How? Sniper fire. You're kidding. Trust me. What if I fall into the sea? I, I can't swim. Then don't doing fall, pretty bitch. good a few minutes ago. Okay. Think you can do it? Would you take no for an answer? No. no. All right, get going. You'll be fine. Okay, there she goes. Let me get this. Let me call him now. Snake, are you close? Keep it together. We're almost there. Just hang on until then. Okay. Oops, wrong button. Snake. Okay, where is my trusty PSG-1? Lethal, yep. And do I have any of them pills? Pentazamine, I already pronounced it, there we go. Ow. Dumbass. Okay, there's... How he didn't hear that, I don't know. How I missed, I don't know. Oh crap. Let's get them out the way. Oh, I saw. Oh, I definitely saw. Oh, uh, yeah. Let's get another one of these. How the fuck? There we go. There's a cipher. Ooh, that was a good shot. Uh oh. No, no, no. No, you don't. Need another one of these. Another cipher. I see him. There we go. We got a cipher again. Let's get him out of there. I'm gonna switch sides. How you zoom in? Let's see. Maybe they'll tell me. Zoom would be zoom. Okay, there we go. Uh, let's get another one of them pills. Oh, thermal. There we go. Gotta get them out of here. over there yet oh I want to try some oh I missed the combo yeah I remember playing this back in the day she'll say so she'll be talking like how cute you are and shit uh let me get my PSG back where's she at right there okay I'm gonna need another, uh, put the thermals back. Oh, 
Oh, shit. This is Snake. Can you hear me? Yeah, nice and clear. I've reached my sniping position on strut E. I'll provide support fire from here. Right. Do me a favor and take out whatever I miss. Just call me when you want me to shoot. Where at? Where at? Where at? There he is. Okay, now we can call him. Damn, I don't think I can do this. Snake, take over for me. I'll take care of it then. I'm going to show you how sniping should be handled. Yeah, take just a good my look. Face. My sniping field will be limited to the area you're watching through your PSG-1 scope. Keep a good lookout on Emma's surroundings, even while I'm shooting, all right? Okay. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, damn, Snake got him. Put the thermals back on. Okay, you stole my kill. Stole my kill again. I think we double teamed it. So I was trying to shoot the bird. I can't do this. Let me listen in on this one. I don't want to do this. How did all this happen? Oh crap, Snake, you better get him. Freeze! Ah! Uh oh. A girl? What are you doing here? It's not by choice, thank you very much. Oh. You're not gonna shoot me. No. Why not? Stay away from good looking women when you're fighting. Otherwise, you'll get hit with diarrhea. Huh? One of the few things I learned from Shadow Moses. Ah. Uh. What? The guy who shit himself. Ancient history. Don't worry about it. Uh, I have no idea what you're talking about, but does this mean you're letting me go? Well, you could have found a nicer way to say that, but sure. Better hurry. Thanks. Don't mention it. Just run like hell. Oh no, my stomach. Not again. Oh. <laughs> this place is about to sink. Just get out fast, okay? Oh. Wait! What? What's your name? Don't have one. Huh? Okay, fine. It's Johnny. Oh. Mm -hmm. Good old Johnny. Okay. Let's get back to our PGS one. Oh, got an achievement for that. Get some ciphers. Ugh. Oh, okay, yeah, 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 we gotta get them claymores. Boy, I almost sniped you, Snake. She should be good now. Oh shit. I need more of this, guaranteed. There we go. Time for the sad part. It's like 
Ant survives. Okay, let me get one of these bad boys right here. Ditch. Oh, motherfucker. Walks on water but falls in it. Still don't make sense. Uh oh. Poor Emma got prison shake. That death scream. I mean, it's not funny, it's just the timing of the sound effect. Emma's been stabbed. That yeah, I bastard. can see that. How bad is it? She's conscious, but the bleeding's bad. I'm bringing her over there right now. <laughs> Ryden, get that disc over here as soon as possible. I'm afraid her time's running out. I'll be there. Time to sprint. your situation over there? Emma seems to be, uh, doing something to GW's defensive capabilities. All we need now is your disc. You better hurry. I don't think she's gonna make it. Don't you How's got bandages or something to stop the bleeding? Just get over here. You'll find the coast is clear with everybody aboard Arsenal right now. Understood. I mean, she's dead either way. I'm just talking. Oh, it's time, shit. And we got the enemy. Let me get this. Socom. What's in here? Nothing. Okay, stop fooling around. What's in here? Oh, got the camera. And you get the trophy for that. Let's drop you. Shit. He ain't paying attention. And I suck. Bye bye. 99. Uh oh, I thought that was a uh, person. Let me get on my mind detector. Something tells me to equip it. Okay, it's just a cipher. Uh, no chaff. Oh, he's way over there. Screw it. Who's calling me? Arsenal's launch has initiated. Okay, so that's the right way. All right. Oh, 
Okay, I got nine, 192 seconds left. I'm pretty sure I got it. Do, do. It'd be fun when them seagulls just took a shit on me. <laughs> okay. Elevator. Yep, made it just in time. No, oh, I forgot they did bandage her. Emma. I think he got some internal organs. We can't stop the bleeding. <sighs> Crazy how in the Metal Gear universe you can bring people back from the dead, but you can't stop some bleeding. I'm here. Got the disc. You're really asking about the disc? It was the person dying. <laughs> Emma set everything up. Uh, apparently, all you have to do is pop in the disc. should insert the virus into the AI. Is it working? Just leave it to Emma. What uh -oh. the? An antibody agent? Damn, the connection's been cut. Is the virus upload complete? I don't think so. The count stopped at 90%. Otacon. I don't think Emma's made any mistakes, but a portion of the worm cluster might have been altered after the disc left Emma's hands. By the Patriots? Will the virus still work? I have no idea. Hal is... Is everything all right? This said he ain't seen his sister in so long and he has to watch her die. Uh, it's all right. Everything's all right. Good. At least I, I won't be adding another page to our family's dark history. Yeah, that's right. What if the virus doesn't work? Either destroy that thing or take out Solidus and his men. How do we get on board? I don't think we can. Unless somebody inside gives us a hand. I... I always... What is it? Wanted to see you again. You don't hate me? Never. I never wanted to get in your way. Time for the sad moment. I never wanted to hurt you. I thought that with Arsenal, if I followed in your footsteps, I could be closer. I just wanted you to look at me. Look at me as... as a woman. Hey, hey. I could never do that. Don't be so honest. It hurts. Sorry. Can I... Can I ask you one last favor? Sure. Call me... Call me... Emma. What? Please call me Emma. No, this is just weird. What's wrong with EE? E? Hey. 
Emma? Emma? She did. Emma? Time for Emma? the sad music. Answer me. We only got the door for a short uh, while. She's like, how always around someone is done. I didn't. I didn't leave you. Because of the accident. I had. I had a relationship with your mother. She seduced me. And it went on. My father's death was no accident. He took his own life. It was my fault, all my fault. Forgive me, Emma. Ow. The parrot just makes it sadder. gear is ready for launch. Evacuate the upper levels immediately. Sounds like they're cutting this area loose. What do you mean? It means we're gonna sink. We have to get the hostages out. What about the camera repairs? Done. We won't be able to get everybody aboard. We'll just have to take as many as we can. My sister... No time for a funeral. She's going with the ocean, unfortunately. Won't be able to come with us. We will be commencing the countdown shortly. Personnel in the upper levels, head for the evacuation area immediately. I'm always the survivor. Why, Wolf? Take care of the hostages. What about you guys? We got other arrangements. Huh? There's our ride out of here. Anyway, we're gonna have to sink that thing if the virus doesn't work. I should be going with you. You've got your job, we've got ours. You mean, I'd only get in your way. Wrong. Only you can save those hostages, got it? Right. Listen, the two of you won't be able to destroy that thing. Eliminate the enemy, that's your only option. Like a badass intro for a movie. It's fucked up, they just left her on the floor. Like on the counter or something. Try to get as many hostages out as you can. It's a short flight to the shore, so don't worry about overloading the cam off. <laughs> Leave it to me. Okay, got the secret of uh, Luke and Shay. Head 
This music goes a long way. I'm counting on you, Otacon. Hal, I miss you. Hal, I miss you. I never understood why they gave the pair the computer voice. find it true four years ago I realized that you can't just wish for a happy family you have to make it happen I only wish I knew that sooner I learned that I could love as you probably did Emma you think he's gonna be okay He's tougher than he looks. Consider it done. Now, how do we open this thing? You can come out now. Uh oh. A ninja? What the? Arsenal's going to take off. We still need you to take care of a few things. This time, do not fail us. Snake, what's this all about? Bedtime, right? Looks like Snake is betrayed us. You're changing sides now? Change sides? I don't recall saying I was on yours. Damn it. You! Ready for some shut eye? Did he betray me? big arsenal was. Jack, are you reading me? Do you want to save your mission data up to this point? Yes, I do, in fact. And that should be some good save time. Your mission data has been saved. Is he still, Is he alive? still alive? He was he when was Olga brought another him Another MGS-1 moment. I've checked I've everything, checked including the genome, genome data, data, but there's nothing on this guy. NSA, CIA, FBI. He doesn't exist in any database. He's a non-existent operative from a non-existent organization. I suspected as much. However, I know this man. You do? Mm. Wake him up.
It's all of this and Ocelot. Two foot bullets. It's been a while, hasn't it? Probably booty Jack the Ripper. You know this fellow? You remember me, don't you? You've grown. Uh oh, I'm getting choked. Hit water. High okay. concentration of cerebral implants. Uh, Have they altered your reminds memory? Reminds me of the torture sequence in MGS1. Got some long ass cutscenes, but they were watching. This Damn, is my son. Naked. I taught him everything. Yeah, y'all def definitely suspect. Jack, I never thought I'd see you again. Man's legs spread glizzied out and everything. You know me? You don't remember your name, your skills. Everything you know, you learn from me. The 80s. A civil war. You were one of the best among the child soldiers that fought in that conflict. When you were barely 10 years old, you became the platoon leader of the small boy unit. At the time, your outstanding kill record earned you several nicknames, including White Devil and Jack the Ripper. Jack, I was your godfather. I named you. When the war ended, you disappeared from the relief center. I wondered what happened to you. I should have known they would recruit you. It's an interesting coincidence. If he's a lackey for the Patriots, I doubt he knows anything of interest. What should we do with him? We'll use him like you suggested. What about Dead Cell? Ignore them. <laughs> uh -oh. Happening again? Could it be that he's here too? <laughs> In another hour, we demonstrate the power of Arsenal gear. Attack with standard weapons, of course. Yes, proceed as planned. At last report, all is well with GW. Hmm. How about the troops? The men are being refitted with Arsenal gear equipment as ordered. You're the spitting image of Big Boss. <laughs> Is that so? Perhaps I should be grateful to this kid for that. This situation, I find it very nostalgic. Where am I? Why, inside Arsenal gear, of course. Actually, we're also inside the memory of Shadow Moses. I'll take this back. You don't need this anymore, do you? A foul wind is blowing. We shall speak again. Don't move. Stay as you are. We're being monitored by a camera. What are you up to? I'm switching over to nano communication. And once again, we're sitting right next to each other. Mr. X? Ninja? Correct. It's me. I thought you were the leader of the Russian troops. No, that was just a smokescreen. A smokescreen? I was sent to provide you support. Support? Who sent you? The Colonel? No, the Patriots. What? I... I deceived my troops, betrayed them. But why? My child is being held hostage by the Patriots. It all started two years ago when I lost my father during the tanker incident. My men and I had nowhere to go. So we joined forces with an illegal Russian organization. The Russian Mafia? Something like that, actually. 
I learned much later that it was a subordinate organization of the Patriots. I was expecting at the time. When I gave birth to my child, it turned out I was in a hospital run by the Patriots. In the morning, my child was gone. My baby is being kept somewhere in this country. Have you ever met your child? No. Once a month, they send me a photo of my child via network. I've never even held the child in my own arms. I see. Given your situation, nobody can blame you for what you did. That's your opinion. What about Snake? I thought you were enemies. He wasn't responsible for my father's death. Actually, we owe him our lives. Two years ago, they were responsible for getting us out of the sinking tanker alive. So you were partners since the incident? No, I only found out the truth shortly before this. Huh? When I confronted him here. You fought with Snake? When? Well, it was around the time you were holding hands with that girl. Snake. So you joined hands with him to pay back a debt? No, mutual like. gain. Mutual gain? My job was to assist you. If Solidus gets away with Arsenal, your mission is a failure. The Patriots would judge that as failure on my part and terminate my child. Putting it simply, my child's life depends on your success. So you did it all for your child. But why would the Patriots want to help me? Are they hoping I'll take Solidus out? No, you're just like me. We're just pawns. Pawns for what purpose? The S3 plan. Huh? You'll figure it out sooner or later. But I wonder if you'll handle the truth. What do you mean? Listen, we haven't got time for this. Solidus will commence his attack any minute. He's got to be stopped. What about the virus? No results so far. I think the Patriots have tampered with the program. Will it work? I don't know. Get me out of this thing. Not yet. I'll release your restraints after I leave this room. Where's my gear? Snake's got everything. I couldn't bring it here. And where do I find Snake? The passageway ahead leads to a hangar. He'll be waiting there. I gave him a card key for the hangar. Does Snake plan to destroy Arsenal gear? No. Even for Snake, it's impossible to completely destroy this thing. The only option is to stop Solidus and his men. What are you going to do? Stay concealed. That's my role. I still can't afford to be discovered. Olga, you can't keep this up. They're bound to find you. Listen, I'll free you in a little while. Brace yourself. <clears throat> what the fuck? This just punched me in the nuts. I got an achievement for that. That's crazy. Okay, I guess she's taking me on loose. Jack, are you all right? Oh, uh, yeah. Jack, is it true? What Solidus said? Yes. It's unbelievable. Drafting small children, sending them to war? It's not allowed under international conventions. ICC rules don't mean a lot in war. Someone told me that there are over 300,000 children in combat right now. I was just one of them. So you remember? I thought your memory had been manipulated by them. It was, but I have nightmares every day. Pieces of the past I can't put together. Why didn't you tell me? You couldn't begin to understand. You wouldn't know that until you try me. I didn't want you to get hurt. <sighs> there was never a real reason for me to fight, except that someone put a gun in my hand. And that someone was him. It wasn't your fault. If I survived the day's fight, I was praised, fed, and had a bed to sleep in. I think I was only six when I held my first AK, but I'm not even sure of that. Jack. I'm not like Snake. I never questioned why we fought. There was no purpose, no way out. They give you a gun, you ask how many to kill. If you didn't, you were the one they shot instead. It's okay. No one is blaming you. We were shown Hollywood action films every day. 
The kind with macho guys and big guns. They call it image training. Ugh. They... they built us from the ground up into killing machines. We were fed once a day. I can still taste the gunpowder they mixed into the food. Mm, gunpowder? In the food? The gunpowder had toluene in it, giving it hallucinogenic properties. Look at the look that of. I want the fuck that drugged, is. Controllable. Oh my god. <sighs> when the Civil War ended, those of us who survived were taken in by NGOs. They gave me a new life in the States. I can't complain. But nothing's changed. The only people who have no problem with my past have secrets and agendas of their own. Terrible nightmares. Every night. I can never forget. Jack. I'm afraid of the night. That's why I don't sleep next to you. You should have told me. Told you what? That I'm a killer? And always have been? No. No. What I hate more than anything else in the world is my own past. I didn't want you or anyone to know about it. <laughs> now I know why I was chosen for this mission. No one can take him on, take him down, except me. <sighs> I've been kept alive this long for this. I knew as soon as I saw Solidus. Jack, I love you the way you are now. You have to believe me. <sighs> I didn't know anything about you, I admit that. Where you were born, how you grew up. But I know that now. And I know that what I feel for you can only get better. And I'll share in your past if that's the price. It doesn't work that way. No one can share the burden of what I've done. It's not one of those warm and fuzzy things couples share. I accept the good and the bad, Jack. That's what you do for someone you love. I don't want to share my past with anyone. I just want to forget about it. Jack, I haven't told you, you know, about what I've done. <sighs> the last two years with you, it's been more than I've ever hoped for. Jack. But I can't go any farther. I know you want to get married. I... But I can't. I can't risk starting a family. There's no way to erase my childhood. <laughs> it's all right, Jack. Please, don't say any more. Okay, I'm free. Well, they ass naked. Yeah, I wanted to add that, uh, I don't know if it's true or not, but I was on Reddit, and, uh, they said they were actually planning on making a, a Metal Gear game where, uh, Snake and R Raiden go, uh, looking for Olga's son. The free, I mean, a uh, child to free him from the Patriots, and, uh, I guess it showed, it was showed how, uh, Raiden became the Cyborg Ninja, because he gets his whole body fucked up. I don't know if that's true or not. No, I can't trust the internet, but, uh, I think I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, Save it here. So let's call up, uh, Rose. Hey, Jack. Save. Normal. Overwrite. Save complete. Take care, Jack. Alrighty, this is the Trick or Treat here. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, end the video now. Thanks for watching. Uh, the next video is gonna be the last one. The finale has been fun. Uh, if you enjoy watching, please thumbs up, comment, share, subscribe, and uh, I'll be seeing you in the future on some more epic gaming adventures. Peace. Yeah, 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 yeah.